What is up YouTube, welcome to Netpulse Gaming, my name is Rian AK Arma97 and I'm bringing you guys some more Battlefield 4 gameplay together with the AEK971. As usual I will start with the specifications of this weapon, but just keep in mind this weapon is a bows in close quarters and the spec sheet will tell you why. Now one single bullet of this weapon can do 30 damage, now that doesn't seem like a whole ton of damage but trust me once I've run over all the specifications you will know why that doesn't really matter here. The accuracy and hip fire are both 50%, quite average, range is 28% and that's why I said that this weapon is a bows in close quarters so keep that in mind, keep everything in mind I say because the things I say make sense in some way or another coming to the rate of fire and that is where this weapon shines in all its glory this weapon can shoot up to 900 rounds a minute now this can be an advantage and a disadvantage advantage it is a bows in close quarters because basically the enemy doesn't have any time to kill you because as soon as you shoot at them they will get re extra recoil they will get suppressed you not you can shoot it you can kill them and you'll run away with the trophy of being the one that killed that guy but if you're taking this weapon outside of its natural habitat and go on a bigger map and you don't quite have the skills on this weapon yet it's a pain in the ass just trust me on that it's not a good idea because let me tell you one thing you shoot you're losing bullets you're trying to aim but it takes a while when you aim to get a good hit now once you have a perfect aim trust me like more than the half of your magazine will be empty and I know cuz I had this several times happening to me so try to train as much as you can with every weapon try to see if it's good for close quarters of long range and pick your weapon every map again now the final specification of this weapon is that it can fire in all fire modes that includes single shot fire burst fire and full automatic fire the attachments that I use on this weapon are a Cobra RDS sight and angled grip and I think a tactical laser but that can change from time to time it can also be a muzzle break of course and that was basically it for this video so if you like my videos give it a thumbs up if you dislike my videos give it a thumbs down and tell me also in the comment section below why you dislike my videos so I can work on things like these and if you want more content like this subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in one of my next videos peace